Assalamu alaikum. Peace be on you. This is Umar Ali back again. We're going to teach you now a drill that I think is the greatest drill ever been taught. You know, I've been dealing with golf going on like 25 years now, and I've seen all the way back to the, where they think golf first started in China, England, all the way here to the United States. And I've never seen anyone do this drill I'm getting ready to do. They have used, you know, a tennis racket to kind of like show you how to golf swing and club moves through the ball. But this drill here that God blessed me with, it tends to make you do everything correct. And what I'm going to do is tap into an old muscle memory that mostly every child has all the way up to grown ups. Everybody picked up a ping pong paddle before. Let me get rid of this golf club. This here instrument here make us do some crazy things because it look crazy. It don't even look, you know, it's all awkward. It ain't a bat. You know what I mean? Simple. It's real. Got a lot of angles on it and everything. So I got this ping pong paddle here that we are all used to. See the handle? It's, it's shaped just like a golf club handle. It's wide and get narrower. Wide now just a little bit. Maybe inch or half, half inch wide. If you look at the similarities of the golf handle, it basically the same. Real skinny. So you tend to grip this ping pong paddle the same way you would grip a golf club. Right here across your fingers. Like that. You control it right, right here. You just bring, fold it back like this here and just hit the ping pong ball on the table. Pop. That's it. Notice how my hips and everything is moved when I go back. You know what I mean? You hit it all day, you're going to do like this here. That's a natural way. It's hard to teach people to move their hips first when they get ready to come back at the ball. With the ping pong paddle, you already can see the hips is winding up fine. And you're hitting square. I remember what Drill used to have us do. Get like this, turn sideways, put this hand here, put this hand here, and just turn it, come back and smack it. Square. I remember that drill way back. Way back. But now, we're going to do it this way. We're going to get a ping pong paddle. And this is a sponge ball. You can hit these inside the house. It's not going to tear up anything. Sponge. Hit yourself side the head with it, whatever. You can hit this or you can use a ping pong ball. Get here. Get in your posture. Remember this the videos we did on five uh, fundamentals of the golf swing. You got your grip. You got that right. Now we're in a posture, then over the ball, right? Butt out, open this foot up, going toward the target. Flat this now just a little bit so you can get a good hip turn. And you sit right here, and where you would have a ball on the ground underneath you, let's put it right here. And put this ball directly over. Now I want you to drop your shoulder, they gonna make you drop your hip. Now you line up. You just go back one piece, take with your hand. Club looking at the ball. Now it's parallel to the target line. Keep turning. Notice how I'm not moving. I'm staying right over this over this ball and holding it. All the way here. Now I'm gonna hit this ball right at that mirror. I'm gonna hit this ball right at this object right here in front of me, the mirror. So I can follow through going to that garbage can, which is the target. But this is intermediate target, so I'm gonna hit this at that, so I make sure when I hit it, it's gonna be going down this way. I don't wanna hit it down that way, but I'm gonna hit it from here. So it look like this. Turn real slow. And then you're gonna come back and smash it right in there. So it's gonna look like this in fast motion. Straight down the field, straight down. You do that about, do it 200 times. I like the number 200. Get you another ping pong ball. Put it right over this ball. Hit that mirror. Turn and foul. Straight down the fairway again. Now let's get rid of the ping pong paddle. Right? Which is just like the golf club. And a handle, there's a paddle. Turn it this way. Same thing. Only thing we're going to do now is just. Make it a little long so we can get down here. I'm gonna move this ball to where I'm gonna, hit, I'm gonna hit a sponge ball. Put this sponge ball right here. Instead of me holding the ball, 
I'm gonna let the ground hold the ball. Let it hold it for me. I'm gonna put it on a tee too. I'm gonna put it on a tee. So I can get it set up so it makes it easy for you to hit it. So you just set it up on the tee, like you tee off on, on a part three. So I'm gonna set my, my, my golf club down with one hand choke down on it, right here so we can control it. Put it right here. And do it just like it's a ping pong paddle, just a long ping pong paddle. So I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna stay right over the ball like I was doing, I was holding the ball like this. And all I'm gonna do now is just turn my hips. You got it mad, you gotta turn me to get back to it. So the shot gonna look like this. Turn, then fly. Straight as hell. It's floating a little bit, but it's going straight down the fairway. I can get a real ball and do the same thing. Put it right here, choke down on it. Ping pong. Right over the ball. Here, go back. Look at that, straight going to the garbage can. Who can't do this, man? This is easy. Old muscle memory that's already programmed into you. Programmed into you. Now we're going to do this. So I'm going to get another sponge ball. Because I'm going to hit this a little further. Put it here on the tee. Where my tee go? Got a bunch of tees. Tee it up. I always tee it up because I want to make sure you make good contact. So we're going to tee it up. Stand over, put the ball in the center of your stance again. Fry that foot out a little bit, fry it up a little bit so you get good, good, good hip turn. Keep that weight on the inside of your arch, right, so you don't slide. And you know I gonna slide anyway, remember, because from being here with the ping pong ball, you turn like this and you ain't gonna slide. You ain't gonna do this. You ain't gonna do this. You ain't gonna raise up. You ain't gonna go down. You gonna stay level and stay right over that ball. Keep it right there and come right back. Bang, hip turn. So we're gonna put this on on the tee, so you make good contact. Put this hand here, look down at the tag line, hit the golf can, intended target, and we're gonna go back the same way, stay right over the ball. Notice that one peak take with it. Notice how I'm looking at the ball. It's square to the off. Club is on my spine end. Right there, it's tilted in. It's not open, right here. Take it back, and go back far as you can. Look how I'm standing, my head standing right over the ball. All my weight is right in here. I'm going turn my hips to everything. Now that I got it full as I can go back here, let's reach up since we're not using the left hand anymore. Let's reach up and grab the hammer. Oh, what is that? It's way back there. Big shoulder turn. So keep stretching. Bring it down there and meet it a little bit. Grab hold to it. Bring this hand down. Now let's go back where the right hand was. Ah, look at that big turn. Look at this turn, man. Shoulder behind the ball, and I'm still on the ball. All I'm going to do now is do the same thing I did with the ping pong paddle, look at them hips turn. Look how I'm standing over the ball. Coming right back, look at, right, right on line, right on plane, right on plane. Keep coming through, hips turn. Hips already facing the target, shoulders still square to the target. When you hit this, it's going straight down. So this is how it look like in, in real time, real motion, it's gonna look like this. Here, turn, just hit it. Look at that ball straight over the garbage can. Hey, who can't do this, man? We can do this. It's just that simple. Hit them good, hit them straight. Keep them in the fairway.